I, I come in here expecting to get the win, and that, that's that's the win I want. You know, no matter how it comes, that that's that's my that's my ultimate goal coming in here is, is getting the win. I I, I would have never called you know called out Daniel and said, hey, let's have a fight. If I didn't truly believe that I could win. Yeah, and Daniel did say he had a little concern with what you said. Some of the comments he said, he thought maybe didn't win, didn't say cheap shot, but he thought you know there were some personal things that were going on that you knew about that you wish, you know that he wishes maybe you would have left alone. Do you have any regrets at all that maybe you, you you took it a little too far? No, I think I think that's a business. You know, we we need to we need to come out here and we're getting in a fight. <laughs> I mean that's that's about as raw as it gets. So. Whatever, whatever leading up to that is, uh, I feel like it's pretty fair game. You took this obviously on very short notice. Uh, how's the weight cut going for you? Oh, great, great. I feel good. I was, I was, uh, I needed something to eat while I was while I was uh, coming into this workout. So, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm pretty. My weight's pretty good. I'm, no worries there. And have you taken a look at the odds, or and what are your thoughts on what somebody, they're giving somebody you? Somebody told me the odds are pretty, uh, pretty crazy. Yeah, they have you at uh, minus eight, eighty-five, I believe, right okay, now. No, as I just to one. Okay. Oh, 15 to one. Okay. Oh, fifteen one. I like that better. So place yeah. your bets. Will you bet no. on yourself? <laughs> I would love to, yeah. Yeah. I just don't have any money. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I I'm uh, I, I'm an underdog kind of guy, you know, that that's my background. So I I've always I'm coming into everything as the underdog and, and I'm always surprising people, so I'm uh, I'm I'm looking forward to it. I feel I feel comfortable there. With the short Short notice, taking the fight on short notice. Mm -hmm. I mean, have you ever done anything like that before? Because this is a, this is huge. Well, our our philosophy is um, j just just because it was so difficult to get fights, um, we just said we're always going to be always trained to be ready for this type of situation. You know, however far fetched it was, that that was in our game plan. So I've I've been I've been training hard. I mean, obviously, you know, you take your take your breaks when you need it. You know, you get banged up here and there, but I mean, I feel like I feel like I've been through a camp myself. You know, it's, it, that's that's not the issue. And I and I think just an overall, you know, living a healthy lifestyle and, and just having that hunger for for this opportunity. That, that's all. That's all I needed. Do you have any concern, being that you haven't fought since 2013, that maybe you're going to be a little rusty, plus the jitters on top of that, all of it compiled, that might affect you? Do you think that might happen? Yeah, I mean, I, there's always there's always that component, you know. But I I think I, I've been I've been in front of a, a crowd, you know, like this, similar to this, plenty of times, and I, I've I've usually performed pretty well. So, I mean, yeah, the the time off for sure, but. We've been training hard. We've been putting ourselves in in scenarios to you know to to make it make it like competition. So I'm not I'm not worried about it. And and you know even if I have a couple jitters, if I if I get nervous and you know maybe lose a lose a, my breath here or there, I still I still think I'm better off than than Daniel coming down coming down from so much weight and and just you know his history of kind of being that guy that likes to likes to take a take a break here and there. Do you feel like you have an advantage? Knowing him, that you, you worked with him before. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, obviously, I haven't, I haven't um, trained MMA with him, but I know the guy. I know the guy pretty well, and I feel like I can exploit his weaknesses pretty easily. Hey, Pat.